kids on Facebook. Millions of them already have pages on the social media site, even if they are lying about their age. Because Facebook bans kids under the age of 13. Now the company is looking into allowing younger kids on the site without needing to lie. Fox 7's Lauren Butrowski is here to explain. Lauren. Well, of course, the big concerns over kids being on Facebook are privacy and security. And Facebook will have to figure out how to tackle those issues first. But as more people sign up for Facebook each day, this may be the direction that social media is heading in. On a hot afternoon during summer break, you'll find many kids anywhere near water. But when they're inside, chances are they're on Facebook. I had to really keep an eye on it. For many parents, that's the only way to allow their kids to be on the social media site. It is the parents' job to monitor what they are doing. There's so many um, ways that kids can hurt each other socially. Uh, they can say a lot of mean things. They can pretend that they're somebody else. As of now, Facebook doesn't allow kids under age 13. My parents say that it's made for college students. But many kids do have pages by lying about their age. Now the company is looking into ways to let kids under age 13 be on the site without having to lie. Brad Bogus with Speak Social, a social media marketing company, says it's only a matter of time before kids will be allowed on the site. I think it's inevitability. I don't think Facebook really decides how we communicate. I think we communicate and Facebook responds by giving us ways to do that. And while he understands parents' concerns, he says it's their job to make sure kids are using the site responsibly. As long as Facebook responds to what parents need for privacy controls and parents can parent their children on how to act and behave in these social networks, then it'll be a great success. Facebook will reportedly look at having preteens sites connected to their parents' accounts in order to comply with federal regulations. Yeah, that would be, that'd be a great idea. I mean, that would be, if I could access him through mine, it'd be, it'd be even better. And that will be the key, parental supervision. Because in this day and age, when kids aren't out playing with their friends, they're keeping up with them online. Just to see what my other friends are doing and just to stay connected to the social world. And we tried to contact Facebook about this, but did not get a response. Now, this could be a long way off. We'll just have to see what happens. In the meantime, there is a safe social media site out there for kids. It's called Kin Valley, and it's a family-oriented site that was started up here in Austin. It's a closed and private network for families and has extensive parental controls. It can also be used for sports teams and organizations. Now, back to Facebook. We want to know what you think about this. Take part in our Fox 7 Your Opinion Counts text poll. Do you think it's a good idea to let kids under age 13 be on Facebook? Text yes or no to 81419. And remember, data and message rates may apply. We've already started this conversation on Facebook and Twitter. You can log on to the MyFox Austin Facebook page and tell us what you think.